Love is in the air on this week's episode of Real It In. I'm Cole, let's talk movies. With Valentine's Day right around the corner, we're in for a treat with three big releases. If you're a fan of cheesy rom-coms like me, then you can't miss Marry Me. Starring Jennifer Lopez and Owen Wilson, this film follows a famous singer who, after being cheated on by a man who she thought would propose to her, agrees to marry a stranger in the audience of one of her concerts. Marry Me is available in theaters and Peacock, a streaming service that I don't think anybody actually has. The second film of the week is I Want You Back. This rom-com stars Charlie Day and Jenny Slate as two 30-somethings who, after seeing their exes get together with new partners, hatch a plan to win them back by destroying their new relationships. You can find this exclusively on Amazon Prime. There's nothing more romantic than murder, and Death on the Nile finally cruises into theaters today promising the murder mystery of the year. However, it's no mystery that this sequel to 2017's Murder on the Orient Express has been a bit of a disaster behind the scenes. Originally slated to release on December 20th of 2019, Death on the Nile has taken on various delays, moving from October 9th to October 23rd of 2020, then to September 17th, 2021, and back once again to today, February 11th, 2022. It doesn't end there though. If you've seen a trailer for this film, you might have noticed the distinct lack of Army Hammer, who, according to leaks, is one of the main characters. That's because last March he was exposed for having, quote, cannibalistic tendencies, which made him a slightly less bankable actor to say the least. However, 20th Century Fox, not wanting yet another delay, chose to skip reshoots. I think they could have made an original film about a cannibal on a cruise ship instead, but that's probably why I'm not in the film industry. As per usual, here are the movies I watched since the last episode. Hey guys, sorry to interrupt the, the little titles that are scrolling by right now, but I have to update you. The Oscars were just announced. So for best picture, we have Belfast, Coda, Don't Look Up, Drive My Car, Dune, King Richard, Licorice Pizza, Nightmare Alley, The Power of the Dog, and West Side Story. The Oscars are on March 27th. I'll keep you guys updated on the next episode of Real It In. Bye-bye. The golden seal of approval for this episode would go to Love, Simon. If you're looking for a great Valentine's Day film, then look no further than this wonderful rom-com starring Nick Robinson. This story follows Simon Spear, a closeted gay man who falls in love with an anonymous classmate over an email chain, and the events that follow after one of his classmates threatens to out him to the whole school. Love, Simon is available on Hulu right now. And that's all for this week's movie news. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, a fantastic Super Bowl Sunday, and until next time, stay fresh, Wildcats.